Can you imagine the bride giving no thought until the wedding day? She wakes up casually, you know, didn't set an alarm or anything, goes in the closet, just grabs any old thing out of the closet to wear. Maybe time to go, I'll call up an Uber, you know, they should be able to get here in time. Ride to the wedding. You know, while she's outside waiting for her cue, the bridal march to come on, she's looking at her phone, trying to make sure she didn't miss any, anything on her, her um, whatever social media feed she's on. And then when she gets to, her, to the altar, of course, her cell dings. And so, I mean, I got I to make sure I didn't miss some kind of like or something. Somebody might like something I did. No, she begins preparing when? The moment she's asked, will you marry me? She tells everyone, and then she recruits an army of assistants to help her, someone to get the invitations ready, someone to make the cake and make sure it's gl glorious, someone else to help her pick out a dress to get her fitted, someone to do her hair, someone else to do her nails, her makeup, someone to scout out venues. Why? Because she wants the wedding perfect for her groom. And when your groom is the king of the universe. But preparation won't happen casually. Mining your discipleship, our being prepared to meet King Jesus won't happen if it's not a priority. We just looked at the cost of discipleship. If Jesus isn't your top priority, then you aren't worthy of him. And thus you won't be at the wedding supper of the Lamb. Of course, the bride who comes prepared only does so if she's excited about the wedding. Are you looking forward to the wedding? Or is it just an event? Well, you know, I mean, if I got to choose, I'd rather be a part of the wedding banquet than what's the other option? The lake of fire? Of course I'm going to choose the wedding. Why wouldn't I? That doesn't sound all that enticing. Let's do the wedding. If that is your only motivation, the wedding sounds better than hell. You're fooling yourself to think you'll be a member of the bridal party.